This video clip presents zone stamp enhancements. Let's select all the room zone stamps in the project using the Find and Select palette. Let's open the Zone Settings dialog from the info box and display the Zone Stamp page. Please note that the selected zones use the Zone Stamp 1 zone stamp. Let's switch to the Zone Settings tab page to modify the content displayed in this zone stamp. Here, we can add or remove rows. For example, we display the zone number in the first row. And we can also add the value of the ceiling height to be displayed in the last row of the stamp. Let's uncheck the Define Order checkbox on the left side. And notice that the Edit Content field appears on the right side of this panel, providing further customization options for the zone. Let's proceed and display the Frame and Details page of the dialog. Here we can set the 2D representation options and also specify the appearance of the text. Let's click OK to accept all changes and close the dialog. Please notice that all zone stamps on the floor plan are instantly updated and display the previously specified content. Let's select all the WC zones on the floor plan and open their settings dialog. The selected zones use the Zone Stamp 2 Zone Stamp. On the Settings page of the dialog, we can specify the display order and the content of this zone as presented earlier. Let's display the Identification page and checkmark the Zone Number checkbox. Let's proceed and display the Finishes and Heights page. Here we can display various wall, floor, and ceiling finishes and also their materials. The height value of the finished floor can also be specified. We can display a height marker and specify that we include an automatically generated or custom generated value or text for the finished floor level. Let's display the area and volume page. Let's check mark the ceiling height checkbox here to add this to the zone stamp. On the area and volume prices page, we can define the specific area or volume prices of the surface finish materials of the zone. Using the last two pages, we can customize the text and the appearance of the zone stamp. Let's click OK to close this dialog and to apply all the previous settings to the WC zones.